Good morning. Day two up in San Francisco. Run in to get some coffee real quick. And then I'm gonna be going to this event. They're coming to pick me up about 8.45, so just enough time to grab some good Joe. Looks like a nice day. at the event. It's actually at the Palace of Fine Arts uh, in an area called the, uh, the Innovation Building. It's over in the back. Lots of other press here. Should be cool. There's probably about 500 press people here right now. This is a pretty big deal. <laughs> Scratch that, there's about a thousand people here. Maybe more. All I want to do is find the restroom.
this place is a zoo. There's got to be about 1,500 people. It just keeps growing and growing, but for good reason. And here's why. So here's the bottom line. Leeco is an integrated, interconnected ecosystem that encompasses five different platforms. It's phones, TVs, VR, bicycle, and cars. And they've created all these products that talk to each other. The presentation was very elaborate, a lot of bells and whistles, a lot of things to talk about. Bottom line is they use the best possible interconnected systems to be able to talk to each other, and that's pretty cool, but at a price point that's significantly lower than just about everything. That excludes the bike and the car. I don't have price points for those things yet. I want to thank the guys at Xeno Group for bringing me up here. This was very informative, really interesting stuff. I, you know, I'm a total Apple guy. I'm not really sure that that these new phones and, and whether I would want to make a change like that. But the thing to do is to go to uh, Le Mall, L-E-M-A-L-L, -L -L, check out this website. And this kind of explains things. It's actually really simple. You can be able to, to join their platform and kind of understand how all the interconnectivity works. I have to say that I'm, I'm, I'm very impressed with the, the way it works and the, and, the, and the fluidness of the system. So it's, it's pretty cool. That being said, I'm not necessarily ready to drop my Apple phone, but if I could get my hands on one of those bikes, I'd be rocking it for sure. That's about it from the Palace Fine Arts Innovation Hangar here in San Francisco. Gonna be jumping on a bus, heading back to the airport and back to the boo. Voila, I'm back, back in Malibu. I, it, it took an hour and a half to fly to San Francisco and an hour to fly back. So it was like really quick on the way back, but we, we sat on the tarmac for about a half an hour. So it kind of kind of worked out the same, but I'm very happy to be back. It is about 86 degrees in Malibu right now. Very warm. Rich Burley, the article came out in the Surfside News. There it is right there. There's Rich, hurricane fighting Ducati. Sweet. All right, that's about it. Uh, big thanks again to the Xeno Group who brought me up to San Francisco to check out some of uh, the eco stuff. Uh, very interesting uh, ecosystem, eco platform, uh, interconnectivity, uh, lots of different things kind of talking to each other. I'm, I'm really looking forward to seeing what's going to be happening with the bicycle, with the car, the, the La C Pro. I think that's a little ways off. And the bike is not gonna be for sale, unfortunately, in the US for quite some time. But when it does, uh, hopefully they'll send me one and I can, you know, poke around a little bit around town, give you guys an idea what it's like to have that bike. I think it's got some really interesting aspects to it. All right, that's it. Uh, once again, it's uh, time for some salad pizza, according to Kathy. Uh, I am back. I'm very excited to be back. Tomorrow we have a spectacular, very cool event that's gonna be happening at the Peterson Museum. It's called the Art of Bugatti. It's the, the grand premiere of this event that's happening over at that museum. Gonna be very cool, uh, go, going around five o'clock in the afternoon. Lots of really interesting people, lots of incredible cards. I'm gonna be there, I'm taking you guys, so we're all gonna be there. Oh, it's gonna be cool. Peace out, my brother. We'll see you tomorrow.